بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم 015 grammar unit 7 lesson 1 the simple future tense the learning objectives dear students by the end of this lesson you will be able to form future time with will use future time with will use will in affirmative and negative statements Use will in yes no questions and WH questions. The simple future tense, affirmative statements, and contractions. Use will plus the base form of the verb, for example, will be, will arrive, with all personal pronouns I, you, we, they, he, she, it, or with the singular or plural form of nouns. In the following examples, Pay attention to the pronunciation of the contracted forms. I will be home at 8 o'clock. Contracted form, I'll be home at 8 o'clock. You will be home at 8 o'clock. You'll be home at 8 o'clock. We will be home at 8 o'clock. We'll be home at 8 o'clock. They will be home at 8 o'clock. They'll be home at 8 o'clock. He will be home at 8 o'clock. He'll be home at 8 o'clock. She will be home at 8 o'clock. She'll be home at 8 o'clock. The plane will arrive at 8 o'clock. It'll arrive at 8 o'clock. So, as you have noticed, we use will plus the base form of the verb with all personal pronouns I, you, we, they, he, she, and it. The simple future tense, negative statements and contractions. Use will not or won't plus the base form of the verb, for example, will not be, will not arrive, with all personal pronouns, I, you, we, they, he, she, it, or with a singular or plural form of nouns. Notice here that the contracted form of will not is want, okay? So we cannot say will Lent. Will end is incorrect. Okay, the contracted form is want. Examples. He will not be home at 8 o'clock. Contracted form. He won't be home at 8 o'clock. She will not be home at 8 o'clock. She won't be home at 8 o'clock. The plane will not arrive at 8 o'clock. It won't arrive at 8 o'clock. I will not be home at 8 o'clock. I won't be home at 8 o'clock. You will not be home at 8 o'clock. You won't be home at 8 o'clock. We will not be home at 8 o'clock. We won't be home at 8 o'clock. They will not be home at 8 o'clock. They won't be home at 8 o'clock. O'clock. So, as you have noticed, we use the negative word not after the verb will and the contracted form is want. The contracted form is want and will not or want is followed by the base form of the verb. The simple future tense, yes, no questions. Begin your yes no question with will. Again, with all personal pronouns I, you, we, they, he, she, or it, or with a singular or plural form of nouns. So here, start your question with will plus subject. Again, the subject could be a personal pronoun or a singular or plural form of nouns plus the base form of the verb after that complete your questions 
examples examples will you be late tonight notice here that the question starts with the verb will followed by the subject followed by the base form with the verb after that complete your question the answer yes I will or I'll be late tonight another example will Salwa give you her email address again notice here that the question starts with the verb will followed by the subject followed by the base form of the verb after that you complete the question will Salwa give you her email address the answer no she won't or she won't give me her email address the simple future tense WH questions begin your WH question with a question word like what where when who why how what time then use the same word order as in yes no question so here we start the question with a question word we start the question with a question word plus well plus the subject okay the subject the subject again could be a noun or a pronoun plus the base form of the verb after that complete your question examples what time will dinner be ready notice here that this question starts with a wh word followed by the verb well followed by the subject followed by the base form of the verb after that complete the question the dinner will be ready at 8 another example why will David stay home today notice that this question starts with a question word followed by the helping verb will followed by the subject followed by the base form of the verb after that complete the question the answer David will stay home because he hurt his knee so as you have noticed we start the WH questions with a question word followed by the helping verb will followed by the subject followed by the base form of the verb after that complete the question the simple future tense the use use will plus the base form of the verb when you decide to do something at the time of speaking we use the simple future tense when you decide now at the time of speaking to do something in the coming future examples oh I left the door open I'll go and shut it notice here that the decision is made now at the time of speaking I'll go and shut the door this is this will happen in the future but the decision is made at the time of speaking another example this box looks heavy I'll help you with it again the decision is made at the time of speaking another example my father will probably call tonight again with the words with words like probably we use the simple future tense also notice that after the verb will we use the base form of the verb we use the base form of the verb thank you for listening